you know, I was a little worried that this smart speaker just didn't work right, but I realized I was doing it wrong. Really? Yeah. Watch this. Ula. Yeah. What's in my hand? Easy. It's in your left hand. What? Did you see that? See what? Tell me you saw that, Derek. No. Hey, guys. Hey, hey Todd. Todd. So, listen. Mitt is just really excited about landing this new Ula account. He wants to see uh, both you in his office about kicking things off. Ooh, wow. Yeah, it's your first big project, huh, Cam? Mm -hmm. You gotta be psyched. Super psyched. But uh, my top developer over here says he's not so sure about it. What, what? is wrong with that guy? Oh, I'm what? sitting right here. Derek, Derek, Derek. Real condescending, Todd. No, poor naive little Derek. That's not any better. Derek, I think that you think that Ula's just like any other virtual assistant. Yes, exactly like that, but broken. Ugh, but she's not. Because she's got access to everything on the web. She's got access to your phone, your laptop, smartwatch, and all your social media. And she's connected to every other Ula on the entire planet. Boom! Okay, okay. Like Skynet. No. Why are you so obsessed with that movie? Ula is intelligent. She's like a billion times smarter than the average human, so... Almost to the point of premonition. <coughs> Skynet! Skynet! All right, you can drop it with the Skynet, okay? Ula doesn't just answer a question you ask her. She tells me what I need to know. Got it? All right, you know what? Let me just show you again. Now, what did I do with that top? Easy. It's in your left hand. Derek's gonna be just a minute. Uh huh. Yeah. No, no, I'm hearing you. I'm hearing you. I got you. No, no, Mom. Listen. How many times do we have to go through this? Okay. You gotta stop ironing my jeans. All right. They're getting really weird lines. Well, I can't be the only one at work wearing jeans with a traveler's crease. Okay. It'd look ridiculous. Come on, Carl! I don't care what she does with her son. No. No, I had to wear the khakis today. I hate khakis. Well, if there's a sale, you're gonna have to take me over the weekend, okay? I gotta go. All right, I love you. What's up with Rip Van Winkle over here? Shh, read this. Oh, I wanna wake up all No, I no, 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 shut up. Just help me down. Just wait, and eventually, I hope he wakes up and just have our meeting. Actually, Cam, this works out kind of perfectly. I wanted a minute to chat with you, old man, old man, man. I just got off the phone with my life coach. And on top of reiterating the fact for the umpteenth thousandth time that you never, ever, 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 ever iron denim, we had a little chat about the Ula project. You talk to your mom about work. I talk to mommy about everything. Of course you do. She brought up some really good points. This technology, it's scary. Check out some of these headlines. Smart speaker certainly seems suspicious. Yeah, those are news reports and they exaggerate. You can't believe everything you read. It's reputable news. Yeah, okay, sure. No, that's the name. It's reputable. See? Then why'd they spell certainly with an S? Oh, you got me there. Ah, uh, Ula, the end of life as we know it. Oh, Derek, of course she's the end of life as we know it. Stupid smartphones were the end of life as we knew it. The printing press, double glazed windows. Get with it, dude. Armageddon. Oh, that's 
bit much. Self-aware speaker, neural AI destined to destroy us. Okay. Leaving behind scorched earth. All right, all right, I get it, okay? Like Skynet. <sighs> Maybe Ula does have a little too much access to people's private information, so... Maybe we'll consider just not taking the project. Yes! Thank you! That's all I wanted. I knew you weren't crazy. Now I can tell mom that you're just like the rest of us. What are we gonna do with uh, Sleepy over here? Maybe I can help. Were you listening to us the whole time? Of course, Cam. That's what I do. I listen, I learn, I help. Who do you think intercepted those embarrassing texts you immediately regretted sending last week? You hacked my phone? You're welcome. We both know you tend to sound like a bad impression of a Jane Austen novel when you're angry. Well, if you think meddling in my personal life is gonna benefit me, then you're stupid. Yeah, what makes you think we want your help anyway? Yeah. Well, you're the enemy. Let me explain that. You can try, but I don't like you. And there is literally nothing you can say to change my mind. I understand, Derek. If that's genuinely how you feel, then I would never want to manipulate that for my benefit. She knows my name. Wow. I'm in love. With what? A disembodied voice? All she did was respond to you. Is that really all it takes? She's very helpful, Cam. Just like- Ew! Stop. Stop. What? I was just gonna say, just like my mom. Oh. Gross, Derek, come on. Can we have to do this no, project? No, no. Be helpful. We're just gonna talk to Mitt and explain everything and just back out of this project so we can save some face and just move on with our lives, okay? We can't take this. No. I don't care what you say. And I don't care what you do to me, Cam. And I don't care that you can beat me at arm wrestling. I'm not afraid of you. Anyone. Certainly not afraid of Mitt Morgan. Ah! Ah! Don't eat me! Oh. oh, hey guys. Sorry about that. Uh, night terrors and all. So, how about that Ula job? We'll take it. 